Hey, I'm Jonathan. I'm Ashley. And we are Tiny Shiny Home. We are in the process of building our off-grid homestead in the middle of the Arizona desert from the ground up. And we're doing it on YouTube. That's right. If you're curious about the story behind our 30-day YouTube video challenges, today we're sharing how Justin Rose encouraged us to make a video every day for 30 days, how we married that idea with a specific definable project, and how we've seen income and viewers and subscribers and revenues grow as a result organically. It's been one wild ride. Let's back up though. You see, Ashley and I have been making things on the internet since 2006. It's true. First there was a cloth diapering business, then there were signs and furniture business. Custom t-shirts that were yes. printed by hand. We've been doing a lot for a long time. Yeah, and so in 2015, we sold everything and we traveled full time with our four kids. A year into that, we sold the trailer we bought a vintage Airstream, we renovated it, we posted a whole bunch of stuff about it, we made a video walkthrough that got almost 500,000 views, and we were still making a grand total of $150 every three months from YouTube. In 2020, we decided to take YouTube seriously, and we committed to making a video every week for a year when we started our adventure here on the homestead. We started with around 4,000 subscribers in 2020. Mm -hmm and grew to about seven in a year. Respectable. Yeah, but our grand total on YouTube came to $150 a month. Pennies, guys, pennies. As 2021 rolled around, we decided this was gonna be the make or break year, and we had to do something crazy. I had been watching homestead videos for years leading up to buying our own homestead, and Justin Rhodes, one thing that he said that really stuck out to me was, he wasn't going to give anybody advice unless he's seen that they've made a video every day for 30 days. Which is crazy. Like, how do you make a video every day for 30 days? I brought that up to Jonathan a lot of times. She, she and, did. Mul and, multiple times. And there was ever there was always like, um... I was like, how no. would we do yeah. that? The way that she finally talked me into it was that we were working on this big project on the homestead. Hyper Adobe Earthbag Solar Shed Office which is a mouthful. We now have over 100 videos if you want to go figure out what it is. But basically, we were living in our Airstream on this property, all six of us. We needed another building. We needed a place for power because we're off grid. I needed an office to work. Mm -hmm. It was going to be a lot of things to us. And we were making very slow progress. <laughs> and so we decided, let's do something crazy. Let's take this idea of making a video each day for 30 days and use it to help get this solar shed thing done faster because we just weren't making a lot of progress. So how did it go? On the project side, we made huge progress. We ran our electrical boxes and conduit, secured our door frame, built and installed our window frames, built an arched doorway form, cut and installed glass bottle bricks, added lentils over the doors and windows, put in bracing and pipes for a mini split air conditioner, added clear story windows, built the roof, filled in space between the roof and the bags with cob and bottle bricks, finished the outside scratch coat, installed doors and windows, and so much more. But that's not what you care about. You <laughs> care about the YouTube numbers, right? So let's talk about that. You said we started at like 7,000 subscribers. Mm -hmm. We actually did one 30 day challenge and then like waited a couple of weeks and did a second 30 day challenge. Mm -hmm. By the end of those two 30 day challenges, we had grown to 12,500 subscribers, which is a pretty decent amount in yeah. 60 days. Yeah. Well, 70 days or whatever yeah. you want to call it. And remember, we were making $150 a month from YouTube. Well, that immediately went up to $900 a month and we launched a membership program which brought in an additional $500 a month. We'll get into that in a minute. And currently we've had over 500,000 views on all of our solar shed videos, which is insane. This is a point where we think it might actually go somewhere. This might just work. It's just crazy enough, it might work. <laughs> Thank you. 
So let's take a second and celebrate this. Not us, because that would be weird. But like the fact that small YouTube channels can actually grow organically just by planning and working really hard. Yeah. Probably if you've researched this topic, you've seen channels say, hey, you can grow from zero to a million subscribers in two weeks. YouTube Growth Hacks. This one secret could increase your viewers by 2.4 gajillion in just two minutes. Uh-huh. Guys. And you'll have a yacht that you can bring all your influencer nice? friends on. Oh, I would love that. Yeah. <laughs> but that's not realistic for the most of us. We learned so much doing these daily video challenges that we're actually launching a six-week guided course to help other YouTubers do their own 30-day challenges. And we'll talk about that later, but for now, let's talk about the five things that we learned doing our own daily videos. Number one, your videos do not have to be perfect. This was really hard for us because we are both perfectionists. Right. We, we want... Would... Sorry. See? You're not perfecting this. <laughs> we would sit on videos for weeks at a time, trying to get them absolutely perfect before they went out. Reshooting parts of it, or like, we didn't like the way we looked in it, or like, guys, when you make a video every day, guess what? That video's gotta go out, and you're just gonna have to get over it. And it was really good for us, because it helped us create a ton of content, and we also got really good at editing quickly, and learning how to like structure our videos, it's sort of trial by fire. It's a really good thing. Number two, you can make time. Yeah, that was when you kept, you know, coming to me with this idea of making a video every day for 30 days. I was like, nope, nope, no way. I was like, other people are doing it. It can be done. <laughs> and I was like, I don't see how in the world that's possible. But it turns out, if you're willing to question everything about your life. And flip things around. You can make it happen. <laughs> you have to learn to be flexible, uh. change your schedule up, maybe not watch Netflix as much maybe change your eating schedule. We switched out grocery duties and laundry duties and meal duties. And like we tried everything and we found a new schedule that works for us so well that we've actually kind of just switched to it because it's so much more efficient. Number three, give yourself a little credit. We're pretty self-deprecating, but what we have learned is that we should give ourselves more credit because even though we're two suburban kids living off grid in the middle of the desert, building an earth bag house, we have no idea what we're doing. <laughs> Hey, but somehow we're making it work. We do a lot of research. We, we do. We do a lot of research. We work really hard. And just because we haven't done something before and we don't think we can do it doesn't mean that we can't. It's very true. So, don't let the old lizard brain get you. You just got to keep making those videos each day if you're going to get through. Number four, bribe your tribe. Yes, we have four kids. And they were a part of all of these videos every single day. They were helping us move dirt and build this building. They were even shooting video and picking music for the videos. They were an integral part of it. And did they want to do it every day? Of course not. Absolutely not. Did we want to do it every day? Not at all. Of course not. <laughs> so you know what? It's okay to bribe them, to mm -hmm. give them something to look forward to. It's okay to give us something to look forward to. Right. Do it. Bribe the tribe. Number five, momentum matters. Come on, babe. Get with the momentum. <laughs> One thing that we didn't anticipate about doing these daily videos is the community and the goodwill that sort of sprung up around the whole project. I cannot tell you how many people have messaged us saying that we get up and have our coffee and we watch your videos every morning. And that was really cool. We've even had people ask, how can we support this channel to have you continue making these videos? Yeah, we had so many people ask us that we decided to launch a membership near the end of the first 30 days and immediately had enough people signing up that we were making three or four times what we were making on YouTube those first months, you know, when we were making a video every year. So it was crazy to see how the momentum from making those daily videos translated into not just higher money from YouTube, but from other things as well. That membership is still going strong today and we are so thankful for our tiny shiny homies. Like we mentioned earlier, we think that there's a great opportunity for small YouTube channels like us to grow organically and gain this momentum in this community. It's hard work, mm -hmm. it's really tough, but it's really rewarding too. And so we are gearing up for a six week guided course. We're gonna take you through 
how you plan, you get your gear, you plan your project and your daily schedule, all the stuff you need to know to get started on it. And then we're gonna help you as you actually go through your 30 days. We'll be there for support, moral support, <laughs> uh, practical support, feedback on videos, all that kind of stuff. We think it's gonna be a lot of fun. It's called 30 Days to a Better You Tube. Tube. <laughs> That's my favorite. My favorite thing about it is the name. If this sounds like something that you're interested in, go to tinyshinyhome.com slash YouTube30, put in your email address, and we will let you know when we're ready to launch. And before then, we're gonna be doing more articles and resources for free to kind of help get you going on it. We're gonna do a daily video planner. I'm working on a gear post right now. It's gonna share all of the, the cameras and the tripods and the microphones and all the stuff that we use to really like streamline making a video every day. Look for things like that if you're interested in this stuff at all. I know this is a little different for our YouTube channel, but we're trying something new. We're getting a little crazy and we think it's going to be a lot of fun. So if you're interested, go to tinyshinyhome.com slash YouTube 30 and that's three zero. And put that email address in and we'll talk to you soon. Hi, I'm Jonathan. I'm Ashley. And we are Tiny Shiny Home. Oh, sorry for <laughs> We are building our off-grid homestead in the middle of the Arizona desert. <sighs> hey. <laughs> Just try again.